We are heading out to do some uh, scouting on the Arizona Strip this weekend, just Josh and I. Um, real quick, cameras. yeah, overnight trip, check some cameras, um, do our thing. So here we are getting started on our weekend. I'm excited yeah, to yeah. be out. Finally. It's been a while. So this is the crappy job about being the passenger is you have to open all the gates. But <laughs> yeah, look what he's doing. Ugh. Trying to make a fool out of me like that. So funny. And it is noon, so uh, our chances of seeing any deers right now are real slim. It's 80 degrees. It's only 80? It's only 80. Dude, nice. It feels like 800 million. It's, it's hot. It's not that hot compared to what it's been. No, it's actually not. When you have the breeze and stuff, it's not too bad. We I we'll be okay. There we're just no heat stroking. Right? Right. Alright. Whoa. The roads are super torn up from the rain that we just recently had. It's bumpy. We're out checking cameras today guys and uh I just found a road shed. I just have my sandals on. Dude, freaking sweet as hell. Oh yeah. Woo! Oh my heck. That is a rad horn. Oh yeah. That's rad. Oh yeah. Right on. And did you hear the thunder freaking roll just yeah. now? Oh, that's a big shed. Oh my dude. goodness gracious. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right there's the car. Right here, I can't, I can't even begin to get him fitted in here, you guys. This is a big freaking horn. Like, you can see my adrenaline's running right now. It wants me shaking. Oh yeah, dude. Right off the road, you guys. Freaking heck yeah. Don't okay, so just kind of looping around. There's the rover right there from where Britt just found that giant, giant roadside bomb there. And uh, I think I might have the other side. I don't know. It's, uh, I got a shed for sure. What side is that again, babe? This is the left side. This is the right side. You have the right side? Yep. I'm gonna actually have Britt probably come pick it up since it's her match. That's only a three point side. Look how big that thing is. It's got a big old hook cheater off of it. That main beam's giant. All right, we're gonna let Britt come get it. I'm gonna hold on. I can't believe this. I mean, that horn she's got is 90 inches all day, 90 inches. Okay, guys. And uh, this horn here, it's not as big, but it's the, the frame of this horn is huge. This buck is awesome. And it's off the side of the road. She just found the dang thing off the side of the road. There she is. She just had to put her boots on. She only had her flip flops on because she's been riding in the pickup. So she's got some awesome pink socks. I heard it. Did you walk closer to it? Right here. Oh, shoot. Heck yeah. Yeah. Pick it up. Right on. <laughs> yeah, look how big that thing is. Right on. Holy crap. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Baby. Dude, I was just thinking, it's like, we have found some pretty good horns. I know. Um, picking up cameras. You yep. found moose. You found a year of uh, lucky. Yep. We are back in the car after that awesome freaking road set that um, I found the first side and then Josh helped me match them up just right quick like it wasn't very long. Wait, what was it? Maybe like two or three minutes after I found the first one? Yeah. And they're brown. 
like this is the most ideal way to find sheds there could ever be. I'm in a car <laughs> <laughs> and I just look out the window and it's like, what? Sheds! Oh, that one sounds strong. Yeah, that did. Putting scratches in my car. Um, but no, he just was laying out there. That was so freaking cool. Like that's one where you gotta be like double take. Like, wait, what? How did nobody see that? How has that been driven by? Like, Josh is pretty sure, sorry, that there's cameras up here on this water that we're headed to. We're coming up here to set a camera. So we haven't been on this road yet um, since last year. But, oh, it was just like right there, like waiting for me. <laughs> it's like a terrible moment, man. Big too. Antlers are freaking rad. And if you don't like antlers, <laughs> you're missing out. And I'm actually kind of glad you don't. So I can have yours. But, man, I'm feeling super freaking thankful right now. Super duper thankful. Plus, if there's a summer storm, and I love thunderstorms. And mom's rolling in right now. Life is good.
wasn't a hundred percent, but <laughs> it sure looked like it. There's the rover. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey guys, we are on our second day of changing out um, SD cards, putting up a couple cameras that didn't get um, put up in farther areas, and oh, that. And it is super, super nice up here. I don't want to go down to where it's really hot. Feel it's probably about 70 degrees, and beautiful I'm really trying to resist the urge to take off and go start looking for sheds because it's so nice we haven't seen nice weather like this at home for a long time I'll show you this place to take a quick little uh, break and stretch our legs while we're doing our cameras. Um, get out here and do a little bit of shed hunting while the uh, temperature isn't too hot out here. We're, we're good. So we figured we'd squeeze some in real quick. It gets to be taxing sitting in the car for that long and that just that one stretch of time I mean I try to get out here and there but still so that's what we're doing hopefully we'll find some sheds I thought this was a mylar balloon oh it is yes indeed frozen and it's very far from frozen but as you can see this is Disney parks and if I understand right, this could have only came from Disneyland. <gasps> and we are on the Arizona Strip. So that's actually pretty cool. I've never found something like that. I find balloons a lot, as you guys know, but what's that say? Just the battery. So it's probably one of their light up balloons that they do. <laughs> That's pretty cool, actually. Okay, so we are out here setting some cameras. And as you can see, see all these little rock chippings and stuff? This is where you find the arrowheads. And this is what will distract the heck out of you um, from finding actual sheds. A lot of them, like I said, are just like chippings of them, excuse me, um, starting to work on a arrowhead or some other tool. 
So occasionally, if you look really hard, you can find a good one that is in its full form. Does that sunset justice? The sky is absolutely beautiful. My What's up, guys? All right, it's been a couple days since we were out here last. Um, Britt found a couple of those giants off the road while we were checking cams and running all over the place. Yep. So we didn't have much time to kind of loop around and see if we could match them up. Actually, we got a little ahead of ourselves. We got a little excited. Yeah, we did. We because, just assumed. Yeah, because they were so close together, we assumed they were a set at first, and we just threw them in the, in the rover and, and took kept off down, down the road and, and kept doing what we were doing all week, and then finally got time to sit down and look at them. And it, I realized that They're they weren't a set. A they were fit. two completely different deer that close. So it's been, what, two days since yeah. you picked those up? And uh, we're back out here, and we're out here kind of multi-purposing again. We're going to look around yeah, and see gonna... if we can match those up. But then we're going to go set some ground blinds tonight after it gets dark on a couple waters um, that we've already checked cameras on. So we got some big, big deer hitting water. So we're going to go put uh, put some ground blinds up. So yes. get ready for the archery hunts coming up in a few weeks. The clouds are coming over, so that should be great. Yeah. Love the clouds. What is it, like 93? What yeah, was it? It, well, it was about 90 on top of this this mountain. It was uh, over a, uh, like 105, I think, when we left town. Yeah, it was so, so hot at home. Miserable. It, it doesn't feel bad right now. So here we go. Hey guys, um, we are just out here on a quick trip. Um, we just found those two big horns um, just the other day while we were doing cameras. And so we're out here looking obviously to match them up and I have a shed. I don't believe that it's a match, but I've got a shed, so right on. There he is. He looks pretty cool. What the heck? Oh, that's a cool horn. Oh, excuse me, I'm an egg horn. Oh, he's broke. That is crazy. Oh my goodness. I almost wonder. I might not. I might actually know what buck this is. I gotta go show Josh. That's pretty cool. All right. Nice. I'm glad I crossed the road. Okay, right there is the first one that I glassed up. I don't know how I've seen that thing. <laughs> so I, I glassed it up and then I started looking around and there's one out in the wide open right here. Actually right there.
Bam. So, we're going to skirt around the edge of this and go over there and pick them up before it gets too dark. Here we go. Well, working over to those shed that just blocked up and come across that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Flying here in the draw. Bleaching out. Oh, well, I got over here finally. Almost stepped on it before I realized I was in the area. Goofy, goofy buck. Look at that eye guard. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That thing is weird. The other one, right up here. Oh, right there. There's the other. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I can see our side of this beautiful. Yep. Matched him up right there on this hillside. I'm gonna glass back where I was at now. See if maybe I can find Brit's other side got to be in here somewhere well <clears throat> it's kind of backwards but looky there I gotta take the long way around but I found that previous shed and now I found a balloon like I said balloons are good luck let's see what is it looks like a star Superstar! Woo! All right. <clears throat> so, Josh has found a few more horns since I was the last here. And as you can see, I am trying to squeeze the very last drop of light out of this place. I want to, I want to match these sheds up. We've found other sheds, but not not the ones that we came to match up. So I'm just trying. It's like when you were a kid and it was dinner time, you had to go home, you had to quit playing. That's exactly what this is like when the sun starts to go down. You just want to keep going. Plus it feels way better. It's not as hot as it was. Looks like we may have to make a trip back here again. But it's a good sign that we found all the other ones that we did. So, can't complain. <laughs> We're in a little rabbit. When we turn and go start going down this next road, they'll be back. They're always through here. There's a pond. <clears throat> no, that's did you need it. that? No, nope, that's not it. Look at how much. I just, don't like to, it to be cluttered. Just look at how much you're using right now with the way it is, and it'll put some perspective as to how much room you still have. Yeah, I'll have to look. Like, I guarantee. I have books and stuff on, on my phone. <gasps> oh, sh dude. Oh, that was scary. <laughs> did you have the video rolling on that? Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah! That was awesome! My knees just jammed <laughs> into the freaking uh, jockey box and my wrist and arm are like smashed. That'll get the blood pumping. Goodness. I don't think you know what you're doing. Nope. Where's all the rabbits? Here's a pond. We'll have some. I don't believe you. You keep saying that. Just watch. Look 
coconut all of them on the bank. Ooh. No, those are. Look at that. Oh, keep oh, your, dear, dear. Keep your camera. I got it on. I got it on. There's, there's another one, one over yep. there. There's two more. Holy over cow, there. there's a ton of them. Oh, that's Ooh, a good buck. Oh, yeah, that's a good buck. There's no way you would be able to see that. They're out of sight. Josh is setting up a blind for his hunters. As cool as trail cameras are, this part does suck. Sitting here, going through SD cards. It is fun to get to see what's on them though. Another big goofy bug. It'd be cool to see what this one finishes out to be. Lots of, uh, lots of character.